Ah, another funny story from the Stalter residence. The house we lived in in Walden, I put an addition onto it. And before I put the siding up and everything, I put the tar paper around it. And of course, Mom, she gets all excited when I go up on the ladder and I was up there high enough, you know. And I'm doing a tar paper. Ernie, my nephew Ernie, was up on the roof. And as I was doing the tar paper, tacking it on, you know, and he would hold it and I'd tack on. And I, instead of going down the ladder and moving the ladder over, I always bounced the ladder over a little bit, right? And then staple up a little more, and then I'd bounce it a little more. And mom's on the back porch there, and she's yelling at me to stop, stop. And next thing you know, I bounced off the deck, off the side of the house. And <laughs> like this I went. And Ernie's up on the roof, grabs a hold of my hand, and here I am dangling there. <laughs> That was a funny one, until they, somebody came and got the ladder set back up for me so I can go back down it. <laughs> That's the funny, crazy one. Funny to him, scary to my mother, I'm sure. <laughs> Do you remember the time you were working over at Aunt Helen and Uncle Al's? And you called Mom and asked her to bring out some tools? And it was sunny as can be there, and you you forgot a tool. Oh. And you asked mom to bring it to you, and it was storming so bad at our house. It was, oh. Do you remember not, that? Not at right, yeah, and yeah. it was like right at the border from Walden um, into Maybrook. Yeah. It was like right there at the border. There, it was clear as could be. Right. Yeah. And we had trees down and everything at our house. Yeah. Yeah. So. But that know. happens. <laughs> yeah. We had that freak, freak, uh. Tornado that storm. one. Storm. Yeah. I forgot what year, uh, what month it was. I think, I don't remember if it was in April or May. We had a freak storm of hail and it came down so much, put holes in the roof of my. Your deck. Deck. Yeah. And. It, we went outside and I had the shovel because it was it was like a good inch and a half of, of hail. I was there at the up. time. And it just all and you had trees come down down the street. One come down and block the street. Yeah. It, it it was fun. I got pictures of it somewhere. But yeah. Um, yeah, that was a heck of a storm too. I remember that one. Yeah. Yep. I remember one year we had such a major snowstorm that I was real young still and school was canceled for like a week or so and we were building tunnels through the snow. That was uh, the, the tunnel you're talking about. That was the year I had parked the car in the yard. And it wasn't going to use it for the winter. I parked it in the yard. And the, every time it snowed and just kept building up and building up. And then I shoveled the sidewalk and throw something in it. And the car was buried completely. And that's when I said, well, I got to get that car out of there. So I dug it out in the back. And then I dug where the door was. And I says, eh, let me try, you know. I click, click, click. I said, nah, wait a minute. So I dug a little bit in the front with a hood where I could open it up and stick um, battery uh, jumper cables onto it. And I did that. It started right up. I drove it out of there. <laughs> yeah, but I remember... And that left a tunnel for you. That left an igloo for you kids right, to play. Right, right. But I remember going over to the Baron's house when they lived off of the main road going towards May Montgomery. Mm. And we we built big tunnels over at their house because the snow was so deep. Oh yeah. And we were just playing yeah, in the tunnels there. Yeah. yeah. 
And then in the small, long part of our front of our house in Walden, we built a tunnel through there. <laughs> I remember that, too. Yeah. So, yeah. Those were the good old days. Yep, they were. 